Hi, my name is Edith Turnwald. I am 84 years and I have lived in Gisborne all that time. I decided to make my own coffin so that I have got my own personal touch to it. And I thought, I want animals that I've had all these animals in my life. And every animal that's on this coffin, I have had in my house. Around the base of my coffin, I have got fields with all animals and trees and clouds. These animals I have had also pets here. I don't find death scary as it comes to us all. I joined the coffin club so that I could make my own coffin and meet all the other members. We had an open day and it's re we had a good response and every week now we're getting new members and people interested. Coffin clubs have been formed all over New Zealand now, just in small areas as it is more personal. The coffin club is, is not a morbid club, it is a happy club. On the day we arrived there, down at the meeting, we are introduced, uh, we are measured for our coffin as everyone is different size. Then we get the basic coffin is already made by our joiners. We're not allowed to go into the joinery part of it with Osh, you know. So then we, they do the basic and then we come along and we pick our plan and paint it and um, we help put the handles on all of that on and do all the lining ourselves. I've done all my lining with wool and knitted all my blankets because I'm going to be warm for many years. <laughs> She's got bubble wrap in there as well. Because I like bubble wrap and I'm going to have something to do, eh? <laughs> I've even got a bell in here. My friend gave me for yeah. Christmas. Well, apparently overseas they have a bell in it because in case you wake up, you know, you're mucked in, you've got to ring it. I said, you better warn my family because they might drop me up. <laughs>